Welcome everyone, this is the unboxing of the Escort. The Escort M2. Yes, the famous radar scanner has invented and created a touchable camera. So this connects, I'm not sure whether it connects to all of them, but I have the Escort Max C and this connects directly to this. And the good thing about this is as well as the GPS, it also has cloud video management. So it's gonna back up all your videos on the cloud. You don't have to worry about SD cards. So what we got going on here? Full, eight, full HD, 1080, awesome. Crystal clear HD videos at night. Enhanced night vision. The cloud video management, awesome. It's about time this was out on the cameras. T tired of... Uh, my SD cards stopped working, I have to replace them. Oh, it's crazy. So we just did download the app. If you've got the Google or the Android phone, this connects directly to your radar. No need to uh, run wires all over the car. Isn't that amazing? Uh, you can scan this app right here for a list of compatible radars. If you want to pause it there and see if yours fits this. So let's take a quick look at the radar before I pull it out of the box. Kind of just, you see, kind of just hooks over the top of your radar unit. Because I know my, my radar unit is mag release, a so quick release. So it's good that the camera comes with it. So I can just put them away quickly. The laser shifter compatible works with all Escort laser shifters. There's a premium safety feature to so send automatic incident reports and mayday alerts in the event of an accident. This is top notch stuff. Here's your cloud management. Instantly share, edit and share footage with the Drive Smarter app. Parking mode. Save valuable footage in the event of a bump or collision while parked. I love that. And of course, built in GPS track and record speed and location information. All right, so the next step, let's get this out of the box. Oh yeah, price-wise, you can pick this up for $1.99. I actually got it on sale, and that's the only reason I bought this from Best Buy. All right, so let's uh, open this up. I don't know. I always try not to be too cut. I mean, not to rip it. Just in case I have to return it. Oh, a box in a box. Look at that. All right, so I just undo the tab at the bottom. I guess the whole box slides out. All right, so I took it out of the box. So again, this is the Escort M2. It's a new camera on the market. Okay, let's take a look at this. Oh, so it's a little smaller than I thought. But... Well, that's cool. So this little arm on the side here is what just connects onto your uh, radar. And there's the SD card slot, which I know this comes with a 16 gig card. Um, I think I believe that's the reset button and power button. These cables, I'm pretty sure it just uses, oh, there's the cable here. This one hooks into the radar, and the one that's in the radar hooks right into here. So that's how they connect to each other. And um, I'm probably going to put the SD card in, but not use it, because I'm going to be using the cloud service. So let's hook this up to the radar, and we'll go for a drive. All right, so just before you go, I noticed, just before we go out to the car, I did notice that there was uh, some more stuff down here. And I pulled it out. It was a USB cable. So I'm guessing this hooks into here too and comes across to the uh, smart cable. And then it comes with this bolt and washer. So I guess it really secures onto the radar unit. All right, let's go to the car. 
All right, so we're in the car, and here we have my uh, Escort Max 360C, and uh, I'll have to pull this off, and we'll go ahead and hook up the Escort M2 camera. All right, so real easy. You t out of the um, suction cup. You take the bolt out of the suction cup, replace it with the longer one they provide in the box, and then just attach the camera to the suction cup. Tighten it up, plug the Ethernet cable from the camera into the radar, and then the power cable into the camera. Line them up so the camera is straight with the radar, and then you're ready to go ahead and um, suction it back to the car. So here we go, this is what it looks like once it's, uh, I don't know if you can see, okay. Once we're hooked up, it's a bit of a, forget about this wire, this is my old camera. I'm gonna take this one down and put it in the uh, rear of the car. So I've always got two going. So there's an animal activist. I want this recording all the time and sending the information up to the cloud. And that way I have evidence. Because if I have any confrontations, I like to have them in front of the car. So right, we're gonna power on and then open the app and record the screen. <laughs> 